The 49ers' second-to-last pick of this 2023 NFL Draft here at Levi's Stadium, number 253, goes to a big-time player in college football, Michigan wide receiver Ronnie Bell. Over 60 catches and over 880 receiving yards this past season. Those of you who watched Jim Harbaugh's Wolverines probably saw Ronnie Bell making a lot of big catches. That was his MO in college. He's quicker than he is fast, the 4'5", 440, which... You know, for the wide receiver position, I guess I would say is average, but above average in the three cone metric and the 20 yard shuttle metric. And he can get open. The issue with Ronnie Bell is one of size and strength. He's about 5'11", 190. He's going to need to add a little bit more muscle onto his frame. The good news is that the 49ers have no immediate pressing need at receivers. So Ronnie Bell, especially since they picked him late in the seventh round, probably to keep him away from other teams who would have scooped him up really quickly as an undrafted priority free agent um the 49ers can develop this guy on the practice squad he doesn't have to make the 53 man roster to eventually thrive in the 49ers system now obviously any pick this late in the draft it's going to be a little bit of a flyer you just you know wait and see what's going to happen over the course of time probably doesn't have the highest potential success rate but uh, you could do worse with a number 253 pick than a receiver who was really productive at a big-time school against big-time competition in college. And Ronnie Bell definitely has good route-running skills, and he definitely has good quickness that I think Kyle Shanahan loves. Kyle Shanahan has long gone after guys who can run the three-cone, who can move around in short area spaces. That quickness gives Ronnie Bell good inside-out versatility. And if he adds some strength to his frame, maybe some good special teams promise because that's been a theme for this 49 draft class uh you know people are wondering why didn't they draft an offensive lineman well what's the point of drafting an offensive lineman here late in the draft uh if he doesn't have a good chance to make the 53 man roster you don't pick guys just so you're going to cut them you pick for the best available players who have a chance to make your roster and special teams is going to be that ticket on a deep team like the 49ers so ronnie bell might have a shot if he doesn't make the 53 you look at the practice squad you continue to develop him and he's got to add some more muscle as time goes by to succeed against press coverage at the nfl level so he doesn't get really eaten alive by the more physical nature of the professional game but that is the 49ers second to last pick one more coming be sure to tune in for the quick analysis of that one